guys, it's Monty and I'm really excited to be filming this video today. And first of all, I'm really sorry for not uploading for like one to two months. I'm just gonna say school and procrastination and laziness is a result of not uploading for this time. So if you hear noise like that, it's because I'm outside again and I don't know, I love filming outside. And it's almost summer, so it's gonna get warmer, so we have some more videos outside, and yay. And my first pet peeve is people who don't put lids on their pens. I don't know about right, but in class when people are writing and they don't have a, like if they have a pen that has a lid on it and they don't have a lid on their pen, it really bothers me because I've always used a lid on my pen and when people don't use a lid on their pen, it kind of bothers me. I'm not sure why, don't ask me why. But that's my first, first pet peeve. My second pet peeve is girls who say they are ugly and fish for compliments. I hate it when girls do this. I hate when they're the most gorgeous girl in the world and they'll be like, I'm ugly. I absolutely hate that. I'm sure every girl's been through this stage in life. I, I know I was like in that stage. If somebody said, oh, you're so pretty, but no thing, no, I'm ugly. So it really bothers me when girls do that. And they know, they obviously know that they're pretty if they're saying they're ugly. But everybody's beautiful in their own way, so do not think that you're ugly. My third pet peeve is people who are, get, who are surprised about their test results but know that they were gonna get that result. So for instance, if you do a test and then you get a good result in it and you're like, oh, I got a good result on my test. Come on girl, you knew you were gonna get a good result on your test. Don't come with that. Like it just makes other people around them feel bad and makes them feel as if they're not worthy or something. I know I hate it when girls do that. And I don't know, it makes, sometimes makes people feel not as good as they think they are and brings them down. So just don't do that, cause it's not nice. My fourth pet peeve is people who disrespect their parents. Now, I'm sure everybody disrespects their parents in some way, like maybe getting angry at them for something, but people who just treat their parents like crap all the time, like, it's, it's why? <laughs> Without them, you wouldn't be here right now, you wouldn't be doing what you like to do, you wouldn't be doing this, that, or do, doing anything, so why would you disrespect them? So. I'm sure everybody has this pet peeve, but that's one of mine. My last pet peeve is when people put socialization over their schoolwork. Now, I know a mouse may sound a little bit nerdy by saying this, but I hate it when people don't focus on their schoolwork and like talk to people or do other things like instead of that. I, my, all my friends know that I hate this. So why would you do that? You're gonna regret it later on in life, so why not start now? I remember my maths teacher said to me, start now because later in life you're gonna be thankful for that you started early and so you won't have to catch up with later in life. So those were all my pet peeves. I'm sorry for not uploading for a long, 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 long time. I will try to get on track once again. <laughs> Thank you so much for still staying with me, even though Thank you so much for staying with me even though I didn't upload for one to two months. I've had my friends been telling me, upload, upload, upload it. I can't. I have assignments to do. All those assignments are done and I'm finally free from schoolwork and I've got my holidays coming up. So, so life is good. So yeah, thanks for subscribing. I love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. See ya.